property owners in the city of Erie will most likely not escape a tax increase in 2020. Chelsea Withers joins us now in the newsroom with more on how much of an increase could be coming to taxpayers and why. Chelsea? Sean, what's currently proposed is for a $100,000 property, that owner would have to pay an extra $145 in taxes. And then for sewer and garbage, they'd have to pay an extra $40 each, giving residents some mixed emotions. Mixed emotions fill the air for city residents after learning that there could be a property tax increase come 2020 after all. We're all in this ship together, right? And we're trying to raise the general, uh, the, the tide, so to speak, of Erie. So let's increase the quality of life for everyone in the town. And if we need to raise taxes a little bit to do that, great. Raising taxes has a negative result. In my mind, we're going to have a smaller tax base and it's going to be perpetual. We'll have to continue to squeeze on the people that stay. So you want people to stay? Let's figure out how to make that happen without raising taxes. The tax debate reignited after city council members decided to wait on a long-term lease for the water system, a deal that would have netted the city some $90 million dollars that now won't help the 2020 budget. City Council President Jim Winarski explained that there is still work to be done for this budget. Nothing is set in stone yet. We still have work to do. We still have uh, seven diligent uh, council people that are looking over this budget closely to see if there's somewhere else we can make some adjustments to help offset some of that tax increase. Winarski went on to say the reason the tax increase is higher than before is due to both the tax Tax increase and a plan to pay more to pay down pension debt. City Council's work continues on Tuesday as they have scheduled another budget session with the Schumer administration with hopes that after that meeting they can have a final vote on the 2020 budget Wednesday. And of course they're facing an end of the month deadline to get that budget done. Absolutely. So after that you have Christmas and then you have another week right. where this has to get in. All right, Chelsea Withers in the newsroom. Thanks Chelsea.